um, that's shown that she's more independent is you send her to bed and she goes to bed by herself now you give her a bottle and she just walks to bed and sleeps herself uh, also she'll um, go and sit on the potty and actually go to the toilet in her potty now so I don't need to go and sit her down my child's only two but I have it like hoovering um, I give him a cloth when I'm dusting um, anything really anything to help it doesn't really do a good job but it's a start Around 18 months, life is exciting for your toddler. They're trying out new skills like walking and talking and developmentally, the words toddler and independence go together. It's independence that they're after. Around two years of age, your toddler will show a desire to start dressing themselves and having a little bit of independence in that area and that's the time to say well done and really praise them for trying to pull on those socks. I can do it. Of course the words me do it are hot on their lips. That's what they want to do. They want to have a try. So it's not really about trying to try your patience, it's about trying out those new skills. There's a more serious side, of course, to this desire for independence because your toddler won't understand about danger. They'll be wanting to run off down the road. And of course, that's the time when to put in some true boundaries for them so they know what you want them to do. But they do have to hold your hand, for example. Using clear, simple, concise sentences with your child about what you want them to do can make life easier in the long run. Now, when finding that you are having to correct your toddler, try and do it in a kind of a way that you're not using the word no. And you're saying, instead of pulling the cat, <laughs> try stroking the cat, so you kind of turn your language around. Oh, put his play with his high chain, he's talking and get him to do it himself. I have a five-year-old son, so when his little sister sees him putting on his clothes, she wants to copy, she wants to have that independence of making her own cereal because she sees him doing it. We want our toddlers to grow up into independent, confident young people. So when you see your toddler able to do something, then certainly give them the encouragement to do it. And then at times when you see them struggling, perhaps to put on their shoes, that's the time to just kind of move in and just give them a little bit of support. Give your toddler choices so that they do have a sense of control and independence, but within parameters. For example, would you like porridge for your breakfast or would you like cornflakes? And at times you'll find that they will ask for your help and then give them simple instructions so that next time they actually can have a go and be successful. The time of toddlers and independence can really be a tremendously rewarding period.